This is where every top-level footballer wants to be after a long season. The Champions League final, only two teams left in the battle for Europe's Premier Club competition. My name's Derek Ray, and I'm joined for commentary on this final tonight by Lee Dixon. It's Paris Saint-Germain up against Marseille. And here is the initial 11 for Paris Saint-Germain. Kaylor Navas starts in goal. Marquinhos plays alongside Presnel Kimpembe at the back. And the main striker is the precocious Kylian Mbappe. And this is it. The final of the UEFA Champions League. It's where everyone wants to be. Only two sides can accomplish that feat. And Lee, it's going to be fascinating to see what happens tonight. Well, it is. It's the big part here. It will be after the game. But as players, it's very difficult to try and stay in the moment and not get carried away. And that's the job of the senior players in the dressing room, but also the coach. Look around your team, see the calm ones, have a word with them, get them to pass the message on. Stick to the game plan, go out and win the game. And here's how it looks for Marseille. Steve Mondonda is the keeper. Hiroki Sakai starts with Jordan Amavi in the fullback positions. Gloria Tova starts with Dimitri Payet in the wide areas. And in this tactical setup, they have just the one player in attack. And he's made headway. The goal then for Paris Saint-Germain, the first one of this Champions League final. Oh, they've got the noses in front. Can they stay there? Now the other team are playing catch-up. Well, here it is again. It's all about the pace in transition. They were so quick to get out from the back. And when he gets through to the keeper, he just smashes it past him. He gives him no chance to think. A lovely finish. Again, and it's a great ball to put him through and he chooses to use power in the finish not much chance for the keeper when he's hit that hard well let's take another look at that goal shall we Goalkeeper mistake. Will there be a price to pay? And it goes! Well, it's one goal after another. A highly impressive performance. Well, we're going to see the replay. The goalkeeper won't want to see this again. He gives the ball away. Still a bit to do, to be fair, but it's his fault. Slightly different vantage point in terms of the goal that was scored. Five minutes left for play, and all pretty decisive. Chance to finish. Couldn't grab hold of it. Oh, and he puts away the second chance. Goalkeeper error. Well, here's the replay, and Derek, a lot of the time, the keeper saved the day. The last line of defence. But he's had a nightmare here. Big mistake. And the goal goes down to him. Full time. Parisian pride shines through. 
PSG have cleared the final hurdle in the Champions League. Well, almost no words are needed. You just look down at the celebrations, the relief after the final whistle. Commiserations to the other players, but it's a celebration time now. All that sacrifice and commitment and desire to win a trophy, and they've won the biggest one. Absolutely brilliant. This is what Paris Saint-Germain have been targeting for a good number of years. It's official now. They are PSG, the best in Europe, Lee. Well, breathe it in. Breathe these moments in. How many times you get the chance to stand on a podium, let alone pick that trophy up. Deep breaths from the captain just before he actually puts his hand on this famous trophy. The cup with the big ears, as they sometimes call it, and it's the property now for this year at any rate of PSG. Well, they've been celebrating long into the night with their friends and family, and quite rightly so. It'll be a late night, Derek, I'm sure. A fantastic feeling for all concerns as they drink it in. The cup with the big ears, as it's affectionately known. And this is the moment, Derek, sharing it with the supporters. You get a chance to take it a little bit closer to those stands. Let them enjoy the experience with you. And the families are up there in the stands as well. A brilliant occasion. It took fire as well as ice on the pitch. Necessary qualities. Well, they've come together in this competition as a team and they're celebrating together now, fully deserved. And you are looking at the best club side in Europe. 